Welcome to the CDMP recap on last night's meeting on the Ganhawage Tobacco Law. Joining us, of course, is Joe Delarond uh, to recap everything for us. Joe, this turns out to be the final um, CDMP meeting before the summer break. There was supposed to be another one scheduled for this tobacco law on the 28th of June, but you got things done last night. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I think uh, without it being rushed, it got completed, but uh, really a very happy uh, time in, in there because it's the tobacco law. So there's going to be some back and forth and sometimes some slightly raised voices and a little frustration here and there. But you know what? After all was said and done, the I think the right thing happened. Um, people were actually happy with the answers they got. If they had a, a concern, it was addressed. And um, to get through the final four sections, about four pages worth, uh, people were surprised. It went right to the end, 8.30, and the last thing was passed. And it was like, wow, we did it. And, and people clapped. People were smiling. They were shaking hands all over the place, especially between people who don't always seem to get along. You know, And that's, uh, that was nice to see. I think it was heartening. And uh, it means that uh, now we, we can take a break from the community decision-making process. It is a lot of work, and, and the people who do the work uh, need the rest. And, uh, but it was a, a nice, a nice uh, feeling in the room last night. Yeah, along with the uh, membership uh, law meeting on Tuesday and this one, it's ending on a very high note. So uh, what happens next with the tobacco law? Okay, so now the uh, drafting group will go back and make uh, any changes that were, were uh, you know, that need to be incorporated. For example, last night there was one change that was debated for a good 20 minutes about uh, the, the banking institution. So that was uh, clarified. The, instead of naming any spe specific financial institution, they kept with the generic term. So it just made it, I think, easier to work with. And uh, But there was some debate, and at the end of the day, that will have to be changed. A few things will be changed from the course of the past six meetings. So um, a community member was selected last night, uh, um, and that was Evelyn uh, Lahash Jacobs. And uh, she's been involved for, for many of the meetings, so she's very familiar with the, the tone and, and what the intentions are. So she is the community oversight uh, member. So as the drafting team goes back, her, goes back to work, her job is to kind of make sure that, yeah, that's what we said. It's uh, one of the safety mechani mechanisms in the community decision-making process. So now, once the drafting team does its job, it'll come back uh, to, to council and then also to the community for the final reading and then uh, we move forward at that point. It looks like that should happen sometime this summer. And then, because uh, this one is in a special process, first of all, it's in the uh, accelerated process, but also it's a different one than any other ones. It's a special kind of a pilot uh, process for the CDMP. Yeah, it kind of crosses over both categories, uh, yes. of regulation and of law that applies to everyone. Um, anything else before uh, we do this final report for the summer, should be? No, but, uh, uh, well, I, the only thing I'd like to say is that uh, thanks to the people who did participate, we had a lot of the people who were there just about every time, uh, along with people coming in and out and different ones, about 20-something uh, people last night, with about 30 in the room with all the people helping, and the local media was there as well. So, uh, yeah, it gives everybody a chance now to say, let's take a break. We did some good work, Gahnawage, and uh, in this case, the CDMP had, like you said, a very good week. Thanks, Joe.